Is he running? I don't know. Uh, he's right there. He's, he's trying to hide in the butch. He's right there. God damn, how many hits with this guy? Bro! How many hits? I didn't hit him at all, excuse me? Oh my gosh, I ran out of ammo. Not working. Alright, I'm just gonna hit him. I'm just gonna hit him because that's the only way it works. That's the only way I damage people. What? <laughs> Oh, going on, buddy. Yo, someone's gonna snipe you right there. He's right there. Right there. Straight, straight, straight. North. North. I'm going to die. Please revive me. I was reloading. I can't. I'm going to die. I think I picked you up. Hurry, you are dying. I see him. Get that fucker. I'm calling for you, bitch. Eni, have you find the data? <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! What? Damn it! <laughs> Don't even think. Okay, that's that's literally what the game is all about. Not all about this, but that's just what the game is called. Is a battle royale game off of three werewolves and 22 survivors I say that much uh, so I'm just gonna do a review for a survivor and then the next video will be a werewolf I want to point you out that as a survivor of that game it's fucking hard let me explain the hitboxes. Oh boy, let me let me tell you about the hitboxes. It, it's it's insane. It's just bad, as you can see in that video right there. Oh, I also got another clip right now if you want to see it. Hold up. Uh, let me just yeah. The you see that? I could even hit the person. Like, I kept going close to the enemy and I'm punching him and for some reason it just doesn't work. It doesn't work out. Like, the game has problems with hitboxes. Like, if I shoot an enemy with a shotgun that is close, it doesn't connect. It just thinks that, oh, it went to the other direction. So I had to precisely aim at its limits and aim at the person that is just, you know, moving around. You want to know how to kill a survivor in this game? Oh, oh it, it's very easy. Well, I, I don't know. Uh, to me, I think it's both. You had to precisely, as I said, you had to precisely aim and you better make sure that that person stands still. Ooh. Boy, that's gonna be hard, right? Because most people move in that game so much. Oh yeah, don't even think about your teammates, because your teammates don't even help you either. Screw your teammates. That's what it's basically saying. Like, just, you should, you know, forget about them, because it doesn't matter in this game. You know, you could just survive. Oh no, it, it takes forever to survive. Like when I meant by forever, it, it's it, it literally takes forever. Now, what are these three data? What the hell it really is? Okay, so if you have played the game or you haven't, well, I'm just gonna explain it anyways. Uh, a data, no data 1.2.0 or 3.0 are these things that you need to um, collect to escape. Now, they're outside of the map, they're not inside, outside. So you have to bring your ass to the datas and collect them and just hide. That's what I do. Or just let your survivors or your random players just get it because you know that's that works too. That's that's honestly fine to be honest. 
so now you're wondering why is it hard now it's hard because the werewolves in that game are OP they hit like a truck and if you get close to them they can honestly one hit you or one tap or maybe like three tap you and that's so they, they can just take away half of your health all right so let's just say like I'm by myself and I'm with a werewolf I keep shooting him because oh no the hitboxes it's not gonna connect and the werewolf slashes me up and that's it I'm screwed I I'm dead and especially I'm not in the corners or anything like that yeah I'm, I'm done it doesn't work it, it just doesn't work now the reason why I said the matches take longer is because I did a video of how long it took to literally fail alright it doesn't even matter if you survive longer you have to collect those datas you you have to I gotta show you something hold up I definitely gotta show you what happens if you don't collect these datas that's me that is all officially me camping hiding the werewolves you see that right there Th those those are three werewolves and they hit you like a truck and look at the survivors it's only me and some random person now the reason why I'm going back and forth towards this uh, fireplace is because that that could you know save my life and I thought that if I keep on surviving longer I'm just gonna win no I failed for some strange reason I gotta collect the last data even though I collected two of them I thought that I will a helicopter would just appear out of nowhere I thought they were just maps nah you have to get the data so all of it and half the times so I just keep on dying out of nowhere I just keep on getting sniped out of nowhere I keep on getting shot out of nowhere even though it doesn't connect it still shoots me out of nowhere because the game wants to be friendly sometimes and the game just wants to be your enemy sometimes. Oh my gosh, it's just how bad it, it is. I tried shooting people so many times and they're not even just gonna, you know, be down. Of how many times? Headshots, body shots, leg shots. It, anything like so far it just doesn't work it really doesn't work at all I've missed so many shots of aiming his ass, it just doesn't work. And if the game wants to be friends with you, then you're in good luck, mate. Like, you, uh, you should be, you know, you should be proud of yourself, of the game is giving you a chance. And, uh, like, most of the times, I die by wolves out of nowhere when I'm just shooting an enemy or I'm just in the middle trying to kill the enemy or strangling the enemy or that any chance uh, yeah uh, a wolf comes in and just kills me out of nowhere because wolves has the best abilities in that game so far than anybody else and that's their only ability speed and launching attacks out of nowhere
it takes a very long time to kill your target and then someone comes in like a werewolf out of nowhere and just you know just scoop you up like it was nothing and same thing with that other person too so it, it takes forever to do your matches like it, it really does at this point I do a certain tactic like I've been doing this whole entire time of doing 20 matches of trying to win at least you want to know the secret guys you want to know the secret camping and hiding is a great solution you could camp and hide and wait for the right moment and there you go and the and just the best solution I've been doing is just going to these big houses, like these logs out of nowhere. You just go inside those logs and put the, just keep on putting that fire thing, and th there you go. You got yourself a, a camp. And I'm um, hiding too because they, they can't spot you for some reason. If you do manage to get spotted by a werewolf or a person, you better make sure that. You kill them as fast as you can. You want to know the secret of that trick? All right, all right, all right. I'm gonna show you. Just yeah, I'm just gonna slide this up to the next one. You see me how I'm in the corner most of the times? Yeah, that's my strategy. All right, that's my strategy. Now, the reason why I do this is because I played a match as a werewolf before and someone was doing this tactic and I couldn't reach him because werewolf's animations and hitboxes are really, really not good when they're trying to get somebody in a corner or close integers. Now, you see, you see while like I'm there in that corner, no one can actually get me. Look, so you see that right there? There's a glitch that you could actually go under, like lie down and you just stay there. Because the, you know, the, the game doesn't know what to do. So, they basically cut off your legs at like blocking it through. That's why I keep on moving upwards, but I'm forcing myself to move down. It's just how the game programs. This game just programs horribly of of the glitches in this and just breaking itself. You can even break the game like how I'm doing. I could just go in this corner and keep on just moving around. This is the best solution and make sure you find uh, a log that has fire into it because that, that's the only way it's going to work. Now, make sure you gotta be aware of things outside, like how I am in this, and make sure you finish what you gotta do. You had to get your good loots, you had to get all this crap, and lucky enough, because I, I just got into a lucky landing. So, this is the only way to survive, and my, my stupid self, I didn't collect the datas. Except for my teammate, my teammate collected the data, not not me, because I thought that if I just keep on surviving longer, it'll work out just perfectly fine. Unfortunately, that didn't work out as I showed you. So, this is like the best solution. What can you do right now? You just sit here and camp around. Yeah, it's boring, but this is the only way you gotta win. I I've been playing this. I've been playing 20 matches of this and it's just really really hard and stupid to survive that's enough of me ranting about a survivor because i'm just done playing as a survivor it's it's just so hard like i don't know i don't understand why would you do this what was the good idea to do this like have you even tested out the game? The developers don't even think. Uh, I think it goes like Benji, whatever the hell it is. Am I pronouncing it correctly or am I pronouncing it wrong? Have you even tried the game out saying, hmm, you know what? Survivor can be hard and we need to fix these things now. Nah, they just 
put it in like it was just hey let's just release it it's gonna be all right how bad could it be ah <sighs> yeah anyways uh i hope you enjoyed the video all right because i i did this crap for you so <sighs> I hope you enjoy, ladies and gentlemen, and I'll see you in the next video or the next live stream. Peace out.